Hello. And welcome to my YouTube video. Today I want to share with you how I design professional PCBs for printing. As a hobbyist I bet you have always wanted to make a professional looking PCB for your projects. In this video I have demonstrated circuit design, PCB design, and how to convert it into Gerber files. So without any further ado, let's begin. There are many PCB design software tools available in the market. The one I have used here is called EasyEDA. It is a free online tool which can be used to make quite complex designs. So first open a web browser, I prefer Chrome. And type in EasyEDA.com, here you can either download the tool or use the online version, which I prefer the most. Click on EasyEDA Designer, on the left side click on Projects and Login, here you can log in using your Google account as I have done. Now click on New Project, and give your project a name. Here I am designing an IR Proximity module, so I name the project IR Proximity Sensor. You can also write a description of your project, save the project, and we can start designing. Easy EDA provides a list of components you can use in this circuit, but if you cannot find the one you are looking for, just click on Libraries. Here we can search any components we want, but before you select the component, make sure the part you are importing has the PCB footprints present already. Once you are happy with your design, save the project by clicking Ctrl S. Now from the top options click on the PCB option and select Convert to PCB. You might be asked to check for unfinished nets. You can check it out to double check your connections or you can skip this. Now place the components as convenient to you. Make sure to place those components physically closer, which needs to be connected. This makes routing easier. After placing all the components as you want, start routing. Easy EDA provides an auto routing tool which can do the routing for you. This tool works great for smaller, less complex circuits. But I suggest you to do the routing manually, as the auto router could make mistakes for more bigger and complex circuits. While routing try to avoid 90 degree turns as it is a bad practice and doesn't look good. If you noticed, I skipped all the ground nets, instead of connecting the ground by traces I use copper area tool to make a copper plate which seves as a ground connection and helps dissipate heat.
With that been done, we can now check how the PCB looks using the 3D viewer. Click on the camera icon and select 3D view. This will enable us to see how the board will look post-production. Now all we have to do is generate the Gerber files which are used by PCB manufacturers for printing our board. On the PCB tab click on G icon and select check DRC, this option will show us any connection errors in our design, if there are any, make sure you recheck the circuit and fix the design. After that we can generate the Gerber files. From here you can either download the files or order directly from JLCPCB. That's all for this video. Now you can start turning your prototypes into professional PCBs. For more details check out the article in the description below. Thanks for watching.